Well, there's nothing quite like this occasion. Welcome to the UEFA Champions League final. The best two teams in Europe this season preparing to go head-to-head -head for the crowd. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined as always on these big occasions by Stuart Robson. It's Barcelona taking on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, you just wonder what those players are thinking right now. Some will be nervous, some will be excited, and some may be anxious. But once that whistle blows, we're going to be in for an absolute classic here. Well, we love to watch Bernardo Silva whenever we get the chance. What kind of performance might we see from him in this one, Stuart? Well, the best players can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. In and around the box, his creativity is excellent. Playing little one-two, balls round the corner, linking up with other teammates, just to have that little bit of penetration. He's going to be key to breaking down this defence. Here's the starting 11 for Barcelona. Marc Andre Ter Stegen in goal. Neymar starts with Lionel Messi in the wide midfield positions. And the starting role in attack is handed to Cristiano Ronaldo. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Nacho Fernandez in central defence. Tony Kroos starts alongside Federico Valverde in central midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. And now the Champions League final commences. De Jong. Neymar. Good looking attack launched by Ronaldo here. Neymar crosses it in, clattered away. An effective challenge. Well, he has the measure of his opponent. And going for goal! Oh, good save! And De Bruyne firing it over. In a good position to clear it away. Oh, fine stop. Ronaldo. Back to Ronaldo. He's done it. What a moment. The opening goal in this Champions League final. And just look at the celebrations. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And then it's a top-class strike from Bernardo Silva. His technique is absolutely spot on. Just look at the power he generates here. Now the action underway. Can Real find a response now? threatening is it going to be oh the equalizer just what they needed and the dream remains very much alive well here's the replay watch how he goes past his man with such ease and it's just a change of pace and then through on goal he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper there's no stopping that what a great finish
So in business once more on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. Messi. Barca know it's a sector of the pitch devoid of defenders. Oh, an incredible clearance. I must say, I didn't see that coming. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Well, it broke down, alas. Real in a good position out wide. Vinicius Junior. I think you've got to conclude that was good refereeing. A free kick in the end after initially playing advantage, but it just wasn't there. Well, no escape, not an immediate yellow card, but the referee deals with him now. Cross towards that far post. Oh, and it goes to propel them into the lead. Just what they wanted. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, and it's a comfortable finish in the end, which is made to look so easy. It's a lovely goal. Well, he can't control his delight, can he? It's a wonderful moment for his team. So back underway. Intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. Has someone to play it to. Just cutting off the supply. And it's Messi going forward. What's he going to do next? Well, as you can see, this is a great bit of skill. He hits it perfectly, doesn't he? And that's a brilliant strike. Well, he knows this is going to be a tough game now. He's got to get his side playing again here. Topsy-turvy game this has been. Look as though there might be a threat, but not so in the end. Good defending. A lot of forward thrust here from Ronaldo. Now, what can he do from this excellent position? Neymar. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. a bit of headway and delivered by Neymar here it comes to nothing in the end Holland and a tidy tackle Tony Kroos Mendy Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. Well, he'd been warned before, and now he's been booked. And he's under big pressure now. He's going to have to tread really carefully here. Quick ball to perhaps catch them out. And the move breaks down. Kevin De Bruyne here's Ronaldo well let's see what they have in store for them on the break and nicely over the top and clears his lines Bernardo Silva onto Ronaldo can he put them in front yes is the emphatic answer and you have to say it was on the cards
Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. first half here at the Estadio Metropolitano. So back in business, the ball moving again, and Real with a bit of work ahead of them. Can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, the referee not messing about. He's cautioned him. Well, it had to be a yellow card, and he knew it was coming. to conclude Stuart an opportunity wasted yeah and the other players are furious with it and rightly so that's such a poor free kick Frankie de Jong here's Ronaldo released it nicely Messi well, sometimes it just comes down to a really poor cross and well positioned to clear Vinicius Junior Real find themselves in a position of menace they could level it oh a goal he's equalised was he made for moments like this on an occasion like this Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And then Haaland finishes it with such quality. Just look how much power he hits this with. It's a top-class goal from a top-class player. Well, that picture says it all. Ancelotti's team are back in the game now. Underway again. We can't complain about a lack of entertainment. 3-3. Neymar. Well, spot on with that challenge his fate lies with the referee who booked him earlier and it is the case that two yellows equal a red well that was always going to happen he just couldn't contain himself could he The defenders know you can't really allow space like that. So a throw in for Real Madrid. And players waiting in the centre. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Had to come up with the ball and did. Really committed himself to the tackle and a throw in now. Ronaldo and Ronaldo oh, tries his luck oh that's a fine save
goodness, that save, fully stretched he was, one for his own highlights reel. The try and keeping it out. Rudiger. Vinicius Junior. Well, no way through. Kunde. Here's Ronaldo. And he's gone into an illegal position, unfortunately. Vinicius Junior. Modric! Magnificent from Mark andre Ter Stegen. Mbappe in the centre. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Kroos has support. Still level. Real Madrid continue to look for what could be a winner. Just couldn't drop his guard, even for a fleeting moment. Under pressure there, the keeper. And Neymar. Kunde. Into the middle from Bernardo Silva. A very effective clearance. Mbappe. Vinicius Junior. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Substitution for Real Madrid. kick delivery from Tony Kroos and the keeper left us in no doubt that that was always going to be his ball that's what you call defending from the front possibilities here and he's kept it out fully stretched somehow reaching it with time running out a corner to Real Madrid real chance oh a breathless moment Real Madrid take the lead in the Champions League final with time running out. Well, here's the replay, and just look how close this is. But it's definitely the right call. That's technology at its best. the circumstances Barcelona have got to go for it time is against them here might still be able to do a bit of damage and there it is Real Madrid Champions League winners well just look at the emotions out there joy and relief on one side despair and heartache on the other but we've got the right winners here they fully deserved it on the night For these players, well, it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. 
Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Real Madrid. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. Well, the celebrations are ongoing. I don't think they're going to be brought to an end anytime soon as they save for the moment with their supporters. And they've certainly played their part, the fans. They deserve to be involved with these celebrations. They've made so much noise here. Photographs will be cherished for years to come. Really top class scenes here. 